Hey guys, Goku Sun for the win here, and welcome back to another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video on my channel. Today, in this video, we're going to be doing something a little different. I haven't done one of these on my channel. I haven't went through a mission on Dokkan Battle ever, or done a boss battle, or anything like that. But today, we are going to be soloing um, kid, the Kid Buu event with only Omega Shenron. Now, I'm doing this because Omega Shenron is out in global. We are on JP today because I can't pull uh, cards for crap on global, or in general. I got lucky on uh, JP with Omega Shenron. Well, kind of. I kind of paid for him uh, with the blue gem. But anyways, we're going to be soloing to him today. Hopefully, uh, we could do some damage. Hopefully, we could win. I have done this before, so I am praying to God that I just... I just went on an attack. That is one thing that I shouldn't be doing. Uh, I should be focusing here, but we're going to go ahead and go into this battle right here. Now, it is very important to bring uh, a few items into this battle. I'm going to show off what I brought here. So I brought off some Sensu Beans for healing, of course. Ghost Usher if I need to skip a turn. We got the uh, Tournament Announcer for some 30% attack boost right here. And then we also got an Orb Changer. Now, uh, it looks like we'll be good first turn. Uh, this should be able to take out the Boo. Uh, I do know that Omega Shenron one shots at least. I, my Omega Shenron one shots. I can't find Omega Shenron friends for crap. Like every time I look for Omega Shenron friends, and these guys super us here. This shouldn't do too much damage. Uh, around yeah, okay, 10k. That that's not that much. But yeah, I haven't found any Omega Shenron friends anywhere. It is super hard to find them now everyone's running super saiyan 4 which is kind of annoying but eh, you can't really do anything about it i'm gonna get rid of all these candy orbs right here and the next turn we'll take him out with uh omega shenron but i did try pulling for super saiyan 4 and it did not work out for me at all uh it kind of sucks actually i used so many stones i did so many multi summons i think i did around like 15 multi summons in total and i didn't get any super saiyan 4 granted i did get a uh, omega shenron which i'm not going to complain about that should give him a super attack and he should be dead now uh about this uh friend omega shenron he's super attack level one i'm super attack level three with ability system or not super attack level three super attack level 10 with the ability system we got a crit right there i'll take that uh even though it didn't really matter but yeah so my omega shenron is going to be doing a lot of damage but this guy, on the other hand, will be, uh, my, uh, friend, Omega Shenron, won't be doing that much damage. Now, I think I'm gonna go oh, Ghost Usher this turn because, uh, I'm not confident. I haven't taken a shot with the Cybermen before on the, uh, Strength-type Boo, so I don't know how much, uh, damage they can actually take from that thing. I know they can live a shot from Super Boo, the, uh, Tech-type one, but the Strength-type... Uh, since he is super effective, I don't know what we could do there. So, I'm gonna go ahead and take a little bit of health off here. And what do we want to do next? See, this is really where I gotta get my... Hmm. I think... Okay, we're gonna take the friend right here. We're gonna drop some orbs. Not exactly gonna get the setup I want. I think if I use an orb changer right here. I do want to take out this... Uh, boo this turn because i can't take a shot i could take a shot with omega shenron but i want to make sure i don't waste any more turns so i do have my items during uh kid boo i do not know if this will take him out though yeah it should actually it should uh my omega shenron is pretty strong i tried this with uh omega shenron and super saiyan 4 super saiyan 4 friend and it was a breeze but uh when you have an omega shenron with a level one super attack this is a little more difficult than uh normal now uh, we're gonna go ahead and try to keep all these red orbs here for next turn. Oh, I could have used this for Omega. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and use this red orb right here so we can get super attacks on both Omegas next turn. And hopefully, I'm pretty sure that should be close to uh, one-shotting Boo. I don't know if Boo, yeah, Boo attacks now. We could take a shot from him if we uh, heal up here. Um, Omega Shenron does have pretty decent defense, as you guys can see right... Actually, uh, there we go. He has pretty decent defense. Mine actually has way more defense because I am in the ability system, but uh, it doesn't really... It shouldn't really matter. We should still do a lot of damage. Now, I'm going to use the tournament announcer right here so we can get an attack boost. And honestly, I don't know who we should attack with first. I don't really think it matters. It really depends on what Kid Buu does. If he super attacks me or whatever he does. I'm going to put myself in front. 
and then we're gonna get a super attack with uh, our friend as well. So hopefully this will do a lot of damage this turn, and the summon's not gonna get a super attack. It's not really gonna matter though. So we're 400k, 400k here. Hopefully, I think this should do 700k around that. Damn, that's a lot of damage. As you guys can see, Omega Shenron, when you put him into the ability system, this guy could do work. Uh, we may have super strong. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna block that easily. But you, we may have super strong leaders now. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and ghost dash for here. We may have super strong leaders like Super Saiyan 4. Uh, Vegeta and Goku, but the mono leaders, Omega Shenron, Gotenks, Vegito, they are still viable. Um, if you don't have any mono leaders in general, I would say you're kind of screwed because it's very difficult. Like, if you have Gogeta, maybe, maybe you could do some damage, but like in the later events that we have, like Omega Shenron event, um, Goku event, like Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan 4 Goku. You can't really do those events with a Gogeta lead. I would really love to see that. I don't know if it's possible. I think if you guys know who Levin Ichigo is, he's a very popular uh, Dokkan YouTuber. He could probably do it. I believe. He's done some crazy things in this game. Uh, more crazy than this run right now. Just taking out this Kid Buu. There we go. So, a solo with Omega Shenron. Not too difficult. This was, I'm pretty sure, one of the first boss missions that ever came out in Dokkan, so it's not that impressive. Uh, I'd like to try a solo on maybe Super Saiyan 3 Goku or Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, one of those. Uh, I don't know if I could do it on, I could do it on Perfect Cell, the tech type one. Probably not on Ultimate Gohan, that would be pretty difficult. But anyways guys, go ahead and give me some ideas in the comment section down below. I'd really like some uh, video ideas for more uh, challenges like this, because this is pretty cool. I was just messing around, trying to get medals on this stage for my uh, AGL Kid Buu, and then I randomly just tried to solo it with Omega Shannon, and it worked. So I wanted to show it off in a video. But anyways guys, if you guys like this video, shoot that like button with Kamehameha.